Measuring lines and midpoint of a line. Um, grade F, G, GCSC, level three, four national curriculum. Now measuring a line is something obviously we've supposed to be doing for a long time. So it's not really um, part of the national curriculum or um, GCSE maths at this level. The key thing here is getting your units right. Also, there are some people that make mistakes on this. So um, obviously it depends on how big your screen is to whether you can see this at the right size. I've made my ruler to be the correct length. Um, if you get hold of the original paper, it should be this length. So the th key thing is that some people don't don't realise is don't use just put it from the end of your ruler. You've got to start from the zero. Once you do that, you should have no problems. So eight, and if we look carefully, we can see that that is what oh, should be eight point four. Oops, I'm drawing on my ruler. Okay, so eight point four. Gives you one mark as a two mark question because you must give your units and as a, regardless of whether you get the 8.4 right you will get one mark if you write centimeters or whatever units you use maybe you use millimeters and it would be 84. okay the next part of the question is to mark on the midpoint so if we know it's 8.4 centimeters long we should know that halfway is half of that which is going to be 4.2 or 42 millimeters and if we carefully go across to we got start from the zero make sure it's on the line and put our little mark there on 4.2 and we have to put a cross to mark the midpoint so make sure we do that um, you'll have um, plus or minus 0 0.2 centimeters or two millimeters either side um, the way these are marked is they have what's called an overlay so a bit of tracing paper or actually now they're marked on computer they'll have some sort of transparency that goes over the top which has a little circle to show where your cross needs to be Okay, and that's a fairly basic question there, but uh, important you get it right.